Okay, hold up, let's talk about this. We did find Ultra Boosts. We found Ultra Boosts right here. These are in the women's section. It's this wonderful women's colorway at this Adidas outlet. One problem, it is full retail price $250 at the Adidas outlet. On opening week, it's the only cool pair of shoes they have here, and it's not even that cool. And it's $250 full retail price, and they have like four other colorways of Ultra Boosts, and they're all $250. That's nuts. Yo guys, what is up? We are back. I have, oh, I just dropped some of the ideas. I have the hat of destiny here again today. I hope all of you guys are doing good. I hope all of you guys are doing great. So you guys know the drill with this. If you saw the video where we had to guess sneakers blindfolded, basically there's a whole bunch of cool ideas in this hat. We pick one out and we have to do that today. If you guys want to add some ideas to this hat, feel free to drop them in the comments. Feel free to email or tweet me or DM Josh so he can see the ideas and put them in the hat. I have no idea what's in here. I have a feeling there's some fun ideas and some not fun ideas and today we're going to be doing another one of them. So I'm going to close my eyes, shake this around a little bit and pick out an idea from the hat and today, okay, this is going to be fun. You guys better hit the like button for this. <sighs> Josh, we're going to have a long day. Mm -hmm. We are going to be shopping at every single <laughs> sneaker store in the entire city. Wow. All right, so I've done the math. There's probably around 15 sneaker stores in the city that we need to hit up. We're not gonna be going stuff like Marshalls and places that sell shoes, but not really the shoes that we're looking for. I figured the best place to start is Livestock. It's just a couple blocks away. Let's get over there right now. All right, so first stop out of 15. This is gonna be a long day. You know what, I guess we'll just find like the three or four best sneakers we have in here, take a look at them. Might come back at the end of all our shopping to buy something. We have these Pumas Chinatown Market Collab. The swoosh or like the, the Puma stripe is Velcro. That is pretty cool. I don't know if there's extra stripes in the box. I'm assuming there probably is. $180, that's expensive for a pair of Pumas. These are pretty fresh though, I like that. Red, green, blue, all in this Velcro stripe. That's pretty cool. They have the black one too, and then on top of that, they have this new Element React 55 colorway. These are very summertimey with this like Laffy Taffy banana yellow, some blue, some darker like maize golden wheat yellow on the inside. You like these? Oh, hey, didn't see you there. If this video gets 10,000 likes, I'm buying Josh these all black Ultra Boosts because like he loves the them so please, much. Please, please, please like 10,000 likes in the yours, like Josh. The please like the video. You know what? Some sleeper shoes, dude, like some. Not super hype, but secret hype. What? These bad boys. Those? Those yeah. are secret hypes? What are they called? I don't know. It's like an Air Max 95 bottom. Yeah. Nike Air Max Tailwind. It's the Nike Air Max You know tailwind. what? It's the little details. Look look real close. You see these little, where the laces are like. The little nubs? Yeah. You're a fan of the nubs? It's the nubs that make it. Second stop of the day, Foot Locker at Portage Place. My buddy is here. He's gonna hook us up with some dope stuff that hasn't come up. I mean, he's not gonna hook us up. He's gonna show it to us. We got some really cool stuff here. The Westbrook 0.2 Summer Edition. These are very cool. Those are cool. Those are all right. These are much better These, in my mind. Honestly, okay, look at this. We've got some slime green. We've got some slime green. We've got some marsh tones. This literally looks like a swamp. This looks very, very cool. Uh, I don't know if this is supposed to be like RIP Russell Westbrook and his Thunder career. That's sad, but this is a very it Houston Rockets makes, looking colorway. It all makes sense. Pink is the tongue of the frog. What? Marshall. What? We got some snakeskin 11s here. This is probably a return. I don't recall seeing these last time I was in here, and this is an older release by a couple months, so who knows why these are here. These are pretty cool. Potential purchase if we don't find anything at the other stores, but these right here, I'm really, really feeling these. These are sick. All right, here's a couple shoes that haven't even come out yet. This is the Jordan Mars 270. I don't know what these look like. I've never seen these in my life. Oh. Oh no, Jamie, why are you showing me these? I need to talk to Jamie about what he's bringing out for me to look at here. You're showing me these? Jordan Fusions? Weird, the air These are so weird. It's a big air bubble. It's a Nike swoosh. It's a Jordan Fusion. I'm not feeling these at all. Put these on the Nike clearance wall, boys and girls. No one's buying those. These guys right here, ooh, these are cool. 
These are cool, the Air Max 200s. I haven't seen these before. These look like really old school and retro, and I'm a fan of these. These are pretty cool. I could get down with these. I like these. These are a lot better. What? And you have these sitting here? Yeah, How are these sitting here? It's 11.5. 11.5? That's like almost my size. I don't need these. I have two pairs of them, but that's crazy that these are still sitting here. Store number three, we are in Champ Sports. Um, they completely rearranged the store. They have these girl Jordan 11 sitting here, which I think are absolutely amazing. Someone please send these to me in a men's size 12, 11 and a half. I'll squeeze an 11, these things are amazing. You are the most boring human I've ever seen in my life. This is the one pair of shoes he picks up. I mean, it's a Jordan 1, so kudos on that. But I've never black. owned a pair of Jordan 1s actually, hey? Really? Nope. We should get you a pair of Jordan 1s. These are, I think, my favorite. No, they're not my favorite. The what about the set. shadows? Those are sick, I've seen them. Right? You like those, bad. they're just black and gray. Yeah. Basic stuff. At store number four is the Foot Locker House of Hoops in this mall. I'm not allowed in here personally for reasons that I've discussed in the past and will not discuss right now. I didn't do anything wrong. The manager just sort of sucks in that store. So Josh is gonna go in, scout it out, see if there's anything good. You ready? Anything good? It was nice. Oh. This is a lot more moving and driving and looking at shoes than I expected. Four stores down, we are going to the outlet mall. There's Adidas, there's Nike. We're not allowed to film in Nike. Yeah, as I suspected, um, not much happening in Nike. Let's check in Adidas just in case, maybe, possibly. I mean, I heard on grand opening, hold up, let's talk about this for a second. Of all the inept business decisions I've ever heard of in my life, having a grand opening on a day where your cash register and till is not working has to be the highest on that list of inept business decisions. The Adidas store opened without being able to accept money for anything and literally couldn't sell products to anyone that wanted to buy them. I mean, there wasn't much there, so I wasn't that disappointed. But they made zero dollars, could not sell anything to anyone. That's a bad look for your grand opening. Come on, guys. Isn't it just great in here, Josh? Where's the Ultra, ultra Boost? They don't have Ultra Boosts. Are you for real? They don't have NMDs. No. They don't have... They don't have superstars. They don't have Ultra Boost they, at the Adidas outlet. No. It's 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 bad, Josh. This is this is the best shoe they have, Josh. <laughs> this is this is the best one I'm, that they have. I'm actually speechless. And this is this just opened up four days ago. That is insane. What did they expect? I don't I don't know. I really don't know. Okay, third Foot Locker of the day. Um, Josh, I think I found your shoes finally. We got some bedazzled vans. Do you, do you like these? Maybe one of each? Excuse me, do you have these in a size 13? They don't have them in a size 13. See, now the problem here with going to a few different Foot Lockers is that we're seeing a lot of the same stock, especially as the first Foot Locker we went into. It's a lot of the same stuff. One really cool thing that I haven't seen, these are nuts. Check out this Air Force one. These are really, really cool. Wow. These are amazing. I, I really like these. I would actually consider buying these. I love this swoosh. I might have to try these on, honestly. This might be that pair of shoes that we end up picking up today. Josh, check these out. I'm noticing a little bit of a problem here. Every store has the same stuff. This is not good. It's all the same stuff in these stores, which is really disappointing. So I figured we need to switch it up, go to the most unique store in the city. It's raining outside right now. My tongue is, I had that red Slurpee and my, my tongue is very red right now. Yo, Eric. What's up? We have a problem. Josh and I have went to every single sneaker store in the city today. Livestock, Foot Locker, some store called Little Burgundy. Skechers? We didn't, we didn't actually go to we Skechers. Go to Shoe Warehouse? Oh, oh, also, Eric, you won Off-White Air Max 90s. Yo, I got some cool shoes, man. Tell us how this happened, I'm so jealous. Bro, fourth try on the Keymaster, and there's no secret to this shit. 
This isn't his key master. He was in Toronto doing this at another store. First key master win ever for your boy. That's amazing. As the Desert Order joints, we didn't even get them in Winnipeg. That's so cool. He got the Air Max 90, like the tan ones with the blue laces. Those are, they're really nice. They had a whole crowd watching and everything. Yeah, you made them cheer. It was really <laughs> funny. It was like he wins and it's silence. Like, Yo, give me some noise, give me He's some like, noise. He's like, cheer. <laughs> I mean, whatever makes you happy. Like, It worked. They weren't even sneakerheads in there, man. It was all tourists. So the final stop of the day is finally going to have some good stuff. At Friday nights, they have a bunch of new stuff in here. Like they have the cool gray Jordan 4s, which are coming out again. This is the old version right here. And the new version comes out next month in August, like August 15th, August 17th, something like that. Maybe even August 3rd. I think they might come out August 3rd. I'm probably going to be picking those up. I think this is a really cool pair of kicks. It's gray. It's white, it's black, there's some yellow on the bottom right there, and then there's a little bit of yellow right there on the flight. I like that, just a little touch. It's like, I'm gray, I'm white, I'm black, I'm boring. But then bang, yellow, just a little bit. Just enough to be classy, not enough to be in your face. I like it, it's cool. And then we have Yeezys upon Yeezys. We have these ones, which I don't know what these are called. Eric, do you know which ones? I don't know the name of these Yeezys. There's a pair of Yeezy 700s, and they're called something. Do you know which ones these are? Uh, they start with a T. Tefra? I think that's it. Okay, these ones might be the Tefra. I'm honestly not sure. Yo, uh, fun fact, when you come into our store, if you ever want to know anything about a sneaker... Oh, it's on the bottom. Check the bottom of the shoe. So what does the name say? The Tefra, bro. It's the Tefra. I thought the black ones were the Tefra. What does the black one say? The black one's the Utility Black, but I thought these ones were the Utility... Vanta! Eric, you messed up your tags. What? These ones yeah. are the Vantas, yeah, no. and these are the Utility Blacks. I'm gonna go ahead and Google. Okay, see I'm right. You can show yourself out of your own store. Bye Eric. I own Friday nights now by the way. We're open 12 till 8, closed on Mondays.